It's okay, it's okay. Hey, hey. Sam, Sam, Sam. Go, 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 go. Hey. Careful, not too much. Not too much. Read it. Keep passing. It's our temple, our temple. Vamos! Come, 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 come! How many, bro? Fuck, 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 fuck. Hey! Don't lose 25! Mic'd up, presented by Ford. How many, bro? Yeah, he's talking about the persistent, persistent infringement. infringement yeah. And again, I, it's one small aspect of the game, but yeah. I think what Minnesota United does really well is they try to upset the rhythm by just those, those little grips and touches and pulls. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not enough for the referee to blow the whistle for a foul, even though I think that's what Freddie and a lot of RSL fans were looking for. But it's just that, that, that constant antagonistic approach with the way that they defend in those two low blocks of four right at the top of their penalty area that, that really – it's not that it's negating the opportunity. It's just kind of redirecting the path of the ball and the buildup. And I think – you know, today, listen, you tip your cap. It was a solid defensive performance for Minnesota United.